we start with breaking news. A College of Charleston student reported missing overnight is now safe at the Sullivan's Island Police Station. Certainly is good news this morning. News 2's Temple Ricky joins us live from outside the police department in Temple. What can you tell us right now? What did you find out? Octavia, officers say a woman drove up in a car and that she had that missing CFC student in her car. She was taken into the police station and is currently being checked out by Sullivan Fire and Rescue. Now let's take a look at what happened. You can see some video on your screen before she was found. The call came in at 1230 for the missing student, and this was on Sullivan's Island Beach at Station 22. The Coast Guard tells us that the student was hanging out on the beach with friends and was last seen walking towards the water. Now, no one really knows what happened after that, but the student is now safe at the Sullivan's Island Police Department. There were expected to be boats launched, more search crews coming out once the sun came up. But once again, that student is safe and there was a Charleston County EMS team that pulled up. They were right behind me, but that team has now gone to the back of the station. I walked back there a little bit earlier to see if I could get an update. If the student was going to be transported, they said they didn't know at the time they were just moving the vehicle. Another update for you. Mount Pleasant Police has arrived to the station. We did see an officer knocking on the door trying to get in. She also walked around to the back of the building where the fire department was stationed and where that ambulance is at. So those are all the updates we have for you. I'll bring more as it becomes available to us. Reporting on Sullivan's Island, Temple Ricky, count on two.